What is up you guys and welcome back again to Hype Geek, the show where we celebrate hype and me just geeking the heck out of things. My name is Colin and today we have another very special unboxing for you guys. I have a couple of stuff that I got from the mail and I can't wait to share this with you. Also, there is a giveaway in this video. So yes, there's a giveaway component. Better stay tuned towards the end of the video to know exactly what it is and how you can actually get your hands on the prize. So yeah, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please consider doing so because we're making more and more videos for you guys. Also, you wouldn't know about our giveaways if you have not subscribed to it. So what are you waiting for? Just click that subscribe button down below. Hit the notification bell right beside it so you know when we come up with a new video. Right now that we have that out of the way, let's go on with this. So I'm going to start with the bigger package first. This is, of course, as you can see, it's from FedEx. Uh, airship to my place. And this is from Bape. Yes sir, this is another Bape episode for you guys. It's not a shoe, obviously, a lit, but um, I think you have an idea what it is already. Now, as I mentioned in my last Bape video, the great thing about buying from Bape International is that you actually get your items really, really quick. I ordered this and three or four days after, I got the parcel already. Now granted, it's been sitting in my place for quite some time because I have been a little bit busy for the past couple of weeks. And uh, yeah, only had time to actually do this now and voila, oh my goodness, boom. So there are two stuff inside here. There's this big plastic bag and then, ha, huh, a vape magazine. So this episode is going to be all about carrying items and carry-alls and bags and such. And we have, well, this is a magazine, but it also includes a Bape Camo carry-all as well. So let's start with this first. Let's start with the main item already. No, wala na paligoy-ligoy. This is like the main event. Look at that. Really big Bape plastic, you know, Ziploc bag. This is what I love about buying from Bape. And of course, you have uh, the Bape you know, tissue paper, the big camo tissue paper here. And when we open it up, let's like take this out. And boom. Kita ba? Ayun. <laughs> boom. Look at that. Look at, oh. Oh. It's a beauty. It's a tote bag. It's a really big tote bag from Babe. I was not expecting it to be this big. I'm actually really happy it's this large and it's super silvery and it's very pristine very futuristic looking Bape camo this is a very special collaboration between Bape and Japanese artist Hajime Soriyama and he's actually been a very prominent figure not just in Japan but you know worldwide as well he found his success during the 80s when he started creating those robot pin-up girls which is basically a futuristic take on like what a pin-up girl would look like in the distant future when robots and androids are pretty much the norm right so yeah um if you have not seen his work if you've seen the 2001 album Aerosmith, he made the cover for that as well. And he was also part of a very special Kim Jones collection for Dior, I believe around 2019, if I'm not mistaken. So as a Hajime Soriyama piece, of course, silver and a lot of metallic stuff is going to be present. Hence the entire color of this bag. There is an outer layer of plastic covering as well, just to give this a little bit more shimmer and added protection as well from the rain and other elements. What I totally love about this is that it's such a signature piece that if you, you know, you use it, if you wear it, um, bring it outside with you, it's automatically going to attract attention. <laughs> and I do love some of the hardware pieces that was integrated and created here. Of course, the Bape text is stylized in a very futuristic sort of way. You also have Sorayama's name here embossed right beneath the huge Bape logo. As I mentioned, I'm really in love with the small hardware details here on the outer pocket of the tote bag. Again, it's replicated, of course, here, which basically also holds the clasp for the tote bag as well. So you can clip it and, you know, seal your bag in a way. If you turn it around, a bathing ape's text is written in full. Again, in its Soriyama stylized font. And the silver nylon band with the Ape Shall Never Kill Ape slogan running alongside the bands and going towards the strap itself. And look at that. Actually, the size is pretty good, you know? It's easy for me to put stuff inside. Let's try to put this in. Boom. Right? 
Now, there's really not a lot of pockets inside the tote bag, which is the very nature of a tote bag. It's just to put everything in. There is a very small, small pocket divider that you can put, I guess, items that you need to like bring around, like your wallet or something, if you want to like place it there. So this tote bag is actually one of the more expensive bags that I bought. This one cost 211 US dollars. So roughly that's more than 10,000, I guess. But it's a really big bag. And I think it's also something that I would probably be using more often than not, especially when travel is more relaxed and we're making headway with this coronavirus thing. Usually when I travel abroad, depending on what I'm actually going to be doing there, I bring more than one piece of bag. So inside my luggage, I have a couple of several smaller bags. So I would have something that I can use and rotate on a daily basis. So this is going to be one of those things that I will definitely be bringing, especially when I go to Japan again, hopefully next year. When we can visit Japan once more, usually this season, usually September, the whole team from Ungeek would go to Tokyo Game Show. Unfortunately, of course, we're still all stuck at home. So yeah, but a man can dream, can he not? Right now for this. If you've seen some of my older videos, you know that the Bape magazine also carries merch with them. Now, these special merch can only be found if you buy the magazine. Now, this magazine is basically their Autumn Winter Collection 2021, so it showcases that. We're going to quickly open it up and see the bag inside or the merch inside. I actually did a giveaway of this, uh, I think... 2019 as well now granted if i bought this in tokyo this would be a whole lot cheaper the cost of this in japan is 2750 yen which is basically half of that in peso so that's how much it is but uh, since i bought this in the international store i had to pay quite a bit this is around 47 us dollars if i'm not mistaken which is not a thousand something pesos but yeah, flipping through the magazine, you can see a lot of the autumn winter stuff. So something to look forward to as well. Huh. I actually can't remember if the older catalogs actually have English text on it, but this one definitely has. Huh, it's interesting. And uh, there's a lot more other interesting stuff coming in from Bape in the next coming months, particularly a collab with Drake's outfit Ovo and Reebok as well. I'm excited. Okay, let's check this camo print shoulder bag that uh, you can get free with the magazine as well. And yeah, not so bad. I mean, even if I have to pay 47 US dollars for this, aside from the magazine, I'm actually getting a free bag inside as well. Of course, as a quote-unquote freebie, you can't really expect much about the quality of, you know, what you're getting. The canvas obviously is a little bit thinner than a lot of the other tote bags or bags from Bape itself, but it's not that bad. It has a certain appeal to it. Plus, it also has this really cute keychain sort of hardware from it as well. This is a nice touch. I like this. You can use it as an accessory, as a, as a bag charm if you want to, or as a legit keychain as well. See? Something like that. Right. So the bag only has an ABC camo on one side. On the other side, it's all black color. It does have a lot of pockets, well, more than the tote bag, obviously. Um, and it does have these. I don't really know the technical term for this. Um, if you know what it is, let me know down below. This usually is used if you want to like clip stuff and just add more to your bag. It's a utilitarian thing. You can definitely do that. There's a lot of space here. And then there are more dividers inside the bag as well. So it's a type of bag that you can literally use and abuse. Considering you did get it for free, definitely abuse it as much as you want. All right, and last but definitely not the least, so from international, the tayo sa local, the tayo sa atin. This is from Everyday Avenue and this is their signature tote bag this is one of the newer collections that they have now everyday avenue is a very new brand it's actually made by a friend of mine as well they were just really starting up during the pandemic and uh, they thought to you know create like a very small business something to keep them busy and just ignite their passions as well and it's these nice really quality material tote bags that they created and it's very witty as well 
So when you open it up, it comes with a thank you card. It says thank you for your order. And then there is a denim tote care tip because obviously this is a denim tote bag. Now a lot of their other tote bags I believe are canvas. This is the first time that they use denim. So boom, yan siya. And it has a really quirky message about getting vaccinated. It says get vaxxed, get vaxxed. The great thing about Everyday Avenue, it's very, very simple. It's just a tote bag with signature lines that are prevalent in you know with what's happening right now in the world a lot of their other older collection was about stuff that you would say on your zoom meetings or on your email something like lovely to e-meet you or i'm sorry my internet is unstable so if you want more of those better check this out and what i love about this is meditation like magnetic clasp button so you can easily close this up as well all right, so inside the tote bag, there is a very small pouch that again is for quick access. You can put your cell phone there, wallet, small items, things that you want to be able to quickly get and extract. You can put it all there and it's very spacious. While it may not be as big as the Bape tote bag, it's actually quite spacious. See? And it's actually this tote bag that we are going to be giving away to you guys. Now the retail of this is somewhere around almost 700, it's like 690 something pesos. I totally forgot what the exact number is. I'll try to remember it and put it down below in the description. But yes, people might think it's a little bit expensive, but you are supporting a local industry as well. And the quality is pretty good. Um, the stitching is nice. Everything is done by hand. Everything is packed by hand as well. All right, so how can you win yourselves a fresh Everyday Avenue tote bag? First of all, you have to be part of this community. So if you have not subscribed, now is the best time to do so. You have to subscribe to this channel. Hit that thumbs up button as well. And you also have to follow Everyday Avenue social pages. I'm going to be putting the link to those down below. Follow them on Facebook. Follow them on IG. And lastly, comment down below if you're planning to get vaxxed or are vaxxed. Let me know that down below and include your IG handle as well so I can contact you if you are the winner. Now, as for my previous giveaway, I am going to be limiting this to residents of Metro Manila only. Or if you live outside of Metro Manila but have a Metro Manila address that I can send this to, puede rin yon. I am only going to be, you know, grab expressing this to one of you. So, yon, let me know down below so we are going to run this until the end of the month plenty of time for you to join and yeah guys please please get vaxxed this is so important right now the numbers are still rising more and more people i know are actually getting this so please if you can please get vaccinated it is going to save your life and the life of your loved ones as well and with that guys this is our episode for today if you like this do give us a thumbs up again just comment down below and join this giveaway if you're vaccinated or not if you're planning to be vaccinated let me know down below Ayan, sali po tayo lahat, okay let's all do our part to end this damn pandemic and with that guys my name is colin and i will be seeing you on the next one guys please keep safe keep healthy bye bye hi peeps peace out